Excuse me? I'm for the GCCE exam. Name? Angelica. Please sit down and start right away. Mr and Mrs Sutton, can you make your way through the door on the right, please? Your time has come. What's happening? The lady seems so nervous. Is everything okay? This is their day of judgement. Through that door is a man who decides whether they go to heaven or to the fiery pits of hell. Now shut up and get on with your exam. Mr John and Mrs Jean Sutton of 29 Cherryburn Gardens. My name is Mr Smith and I will be your judgement officer today. <laughs> it's okay love. Now we've talked about this. Death isn't the end of the world, you know. Sadly, that is not always the case. Mr Sutton, you have led a good and productive life on earth. You were a hard worker, a loyal husband, and a caring and supportive father. Mrs Sutton, you are a tart. Allow me to consult my files to illustrate the point. You have cheated on your husband countless times. The most recent, I believe, at four o'clock yesterday afternoon. You supposedly nipped to the chemist to pick up your prescription, but instead had a quick one with Derek from next door. Gee, with Derek? How could you? <laughs> Allow me to continue. Hello, Trouble1981, God speaking. Uh, no. Oh, no, sorry, you're wanting Buddha. He's in a different department. Would you like his extension number? OK, then. Well, thanks for calling. And remember, vote Christian. You're trying hard to concentrate on an important task whilst being constantly harassed. Excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry to bother you. You're ruining the symmetry of the room by sitting there. And as if that's not bad enough, you're getting dust everywhere. I can see it. It's evil. I'm so sorry. Where would you like me to sit? You sit over there, please. That's fine. Sit! I'm sorry. The, the dust, it's everywhere. you think he'd be able to afford a cleaner. I don't even know how it gets in here. It's so unsanitary. And the sloppy interior design is just laziness. Mr. Warner Roberts, can you make your way through the door on the right, please? Mr. Smith can see you now. Do you know your name badge is completely out of sync with the cut of your shirt? It's very unprofessional. I suppose you know why you're here. Due to your obsessive, compulsive nature, you caused serious injury to five innocent people and the death of a puppy. A puppy, Warner Roberts! You are here now to be judged as to whether you go to heaven or to hell. However, yours is a special case. You kill through no malice, you have a pure heart. But we cannot get over the death of the puppy. This has to go over my head. I need to make a call. Hello, switchboard. God, please. God speaking. Smith here, God. Sorry to disturb you. I need a quick decision on a judgement. I can't really help you there, Smith. That's the job of the board. I'm more of your executive figure, head face of heaven guy now. No real power anymore. Blast television. It ruined religion. I understand that, your almightiness. And usually I wouldn't disturb you, but the board is at lunch. Can I just give you the details? Now speak. It's that puppy killer. Oh, lord of cute furry things. Ah, yes, I got the memo about him. The, the obsessive compulsive. As far as I'm aware, he didn't kill the puppy out of spite, so I think you should rule in favour of heaven. Uh, Owen Smith? Yes? 
How's that trainee angel doing? Perfect. Oh, creator of wide open spaces. Fantastic. I'll let Gabriel know.